Hey gardeners, so I am harvesting early potatoes. So when I came back from out of town, the ones I had in containers were dying. And then I realized I planted these in the greenhouse in February. So that's why they're dying. They're ready to be harvested. So I kinda, I pulled a few last night just to, to see little red potatoes and my golden potatoes. So I didn't plant russets this year. Um, I, I don't care for them and I found the texture off last year. If I'm not gonna eat them, don't plant them. I mean, I'm just planting stuff I actually eat. And I planted about, I don't know, a few from, I guess about a quarter pound in each um, container. And I planted the rest in the big bed. So, stay till the end, because I'm gonna weigh them, and you'll see how many potatoes I got from, I don't know, uh, a half pound of uh, seedling potatoes. But, yeah, so I'm gonna get started. Oh, let me show you what they look like so you'll know. What they, what, so you'll know when you should really harvest your potatoes. Unless you live up north, you might have to go by the guidelines. I live in the south, I live in Georgia, just west of uh, Atlanta. So when the greens die back, it is time to harvest. Let me show you what they look like. So like I said, I pulled some last night because I was curious, but I left the rest for today for the video. A glove so I don't get a bunch of dirt under my nails. Red potatoes. I'm so excited. They're a little small. I might have should have fertilized them more than once. Of course, red potatoes are small. I like small red potatoes, um, but these are really small. Okay, now on to the golden potatoes. Golden potatoes. So, I think part of the problem is this wasn't really loose soil. I used a lot of native dirt, and our native dirt is real clay. I, I, my son hadn't brought me the soil yet, and I didn't have a lot of um, good soil, but I mixed compost with the native dirt, and it's still very, very clay, so. Uh, yeah, I should have sprung for a bag of uh, topsoil. I've got a lot of, uh, I've got a lot of worms in here though. Can you see them? I'm gonna put them in my potato bed. Okay, I think that's it. I think that's all I need to get out of this. Okay, well. And also, I planted these early in February, which is really too early uh, for my part of Georgia. I think Lazy Dog already had a harvest of potatoes. He's further south than I, I am though. So he can plant his potatoes in February. I really can't. Um, I have to really wait till late March, early April. But um, so in about, six weeks we'll see four to six weeks we'll see how that that harvest did but let's weigh these uh potatoes and uh see what i got out of it okay it looks like i got about two pounds of potatoes so that's not great you know for a half pound of seeds uh seedlings um potato seedlings but i planted them early because i was curious and I only fertilize them once. So I think the um, potato beds will do better. But I'm gonna ask you real quick, and I should have asked you this early in the video for 60% of y'all um, 
clicked off and quit watching. But I am so close to 100 subscribers. If you could please subscribe, I'd appreciate it so much. Um, I, I want to hit that first 100 mark. I really do. Also, I am very soon going to launch a cooking channel. I am Cajun. I am from New Iberia. And um, I don't cook anymore. My kids grew up and my husband's vegan and I just don't cook anymore. I mean, for one. So I thought if I started cooking for you guys and um, then I'd have a reason to be in the kitchen again. So look for that. I'm going to start. I'm going to launch that really soon. But I'm, gone, I'm out for now and uh, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.